Skeletons, it's Disney Queen Skelly here. Welcome back to another Versus video. So this one is a, a lot of verses. It's going to be the Disney Gallery versus American Heritage Gallery versus Bijutsu Khan Gallery versus Gallery of Art and History versus Mexico Folk Art Gallery versus the Save Church Gallery. I know that's a lot, guys, but I promise you it'll be so worth it. Um, so let's get into those verses, and you can tell me at the end which one you think is the better gallery. The Disney Gallery, a hidden treasure, celebrates 25 years at Disneyland Park. It's hard to believe that 25 years ago today, on July 11, 2012, the Disneyland, the Disney Gallery first opened its doors as a home to many of us at Disneyland Park. For the first 20 years, this location sat high above Pirates of the Caribbean in New Orleans Square, tucked away from the world below, a hidden treasure waiting to be discovered by passerby. A place conceptually designed as Walt Disney's royal suite where he could entertain and host notable public figures and family. The location became a home and to numerous exhibits that lined the walls and rooms, filled with conceptual artwork that captured our imaginations and told countless stories over the years. And of course, it's home. it's been home to many generations of great Disney artists, Imagineers, and Disney legends who stopped by for a visit many, many a time meeting many of you, or Disney fans, our Disney fans. Taking a brief hiatus in 2007 from its original location, the Disneyland Gallery reopened in 2009, becoming one of the first welcoming attractions you encounter when entertaining Main Street, when entering Main Street, USA. In its current home, the Disney Gallery continues the tradition of great storytelling through frequently changing exhibits such as one installation, crowning our achievements, creating castles for magic kingdoms. The Disney Gallery has been our home away from home, so we welcome you to make it yours too. Next is the American Heritage Gallery. About the collection, explore the artistry of American Indian communities and learn about traditional Native influences. Creating tradition, innovation, and change in American Indian art showcases authentic historical Native artifacts alongside contemporary works of American Indian art, demonstrating examples of a cultural traditions which have been handed down through generations. Native communities from seven ge geographic regions across the United States are included in the gallery. Their art represents the richness, depth, and diversity of Native cultures past and present. Among the featured artists with works on display are fashion designer Lauren Aragon, Acoma Pueblo, noted doll maker Glenda McKay, Ingalik Athaboscan, and Juanita Growing Thunder, Asini Boyin Sui from the Growing Thunder family of Montana. This collection is made possible through the collaboration of the Museum of Indian Arts and Culture, MIAC, in Santa Fe, New Mexico, and the Smithsonian National Museum of the American Indian, NMAI, in Washington, D.C. Interactive Storytelling As you browse the gallery, enjoy the enriching, immersive storytelling experience with interactive displays. Installations throughout the ex exhibition can help you further explore the art, art artifacts and history with narration and insights provided by some of the artists themselves. Next, we'll be looking at the Bijutsu Khan Gallery. We had no idea quite, oh, and I will add that these are just two quotes that I found online from people who have visited the gallery. We had no, we had no idea Kauai was such a strong and significant influence in Japanese culture. The World Showcase at Epcot is all about culture and education. This little part of Japan is fascinating and really helps you understand the wonderful culture and people of Japan. Next is the Gallery of Art and History. The challenge of the desert, then and now. Race against the sun, ancient technique to modern contemption. Competition offers unique perspectives of life in the Sahara, in the Sahara exploring the fascinating story of Morocco's indigenous people and showcasing two modern day extreme racing events. The Bourbons, thriving in the Sahara, Berber tribe have flourished for thousands of years in a challenging desert environment. Experience their amazing culture and learn the secrets to their centuries of success in the Sahara. Marathon of the Sands, Marathon de Sables, a six-day, 155-mile race across the scorching Sahara is anything but a fun run. 
Explore a lifelike diorama featuring authentic race gear and imagine yourself in the heat of con competition. Rally of the Gazeas. Rallier Aicha des Gazeas du Maroc. Maroc. Good lord. <laughs> Fasten your seat belts for this all women off road race where navigation skills, determination, and teamwork mean the difference between getting ahead and going off course. An immersive vision it highlights the events and offers an interactive photo opportunity. The gallery. The space for the exhibit is housed is just as striking, just as striking as the art. Every surface is embellished with bold geometric shapes and delicate outcut patterns from its ceramic floors tiles to its ironwork light fixtures. Next is the Mexico Folk Art Gallery. Bringing Day of the Dead to life, you're invited to Remember Me, La Celebración de, de, del Día de los Muertos, an, ex, an exhibit that captures the beauty and spirit of the Day of the Dead holiday. One of the most up, important events on the country's calendar. Country's calendar. The celebration honors the dearly departed with parades, elaborate costumes, and vibrant arts and arts and crafts. Tour the gallery's intricately cut pieces of papel picado, as well as calaveras or decorative skulls made of sugar. See pre-Hispanic art that hints at the day's beginnings and contemporary pieces that highlight its influences in modern Mexican life. Don't miss the iconic sculpture bridal, bridal couple who did not let death part them. And last but not least, we have the State Church Gallery. Explore Viking lore. View historical items, some displayed outside of Norway for the first time, to explore how the Vikings' beliefs impacted their daily life. Uncover the stories that guided the Vikings, beginning with the creation myth that explains how the world was, crea was created from the bones of giants held together by a gigantic tree and populated by bold gods who are inspired in heroic and ruthless deeds. Marvel at their heroic ancient deities, including Odin, ruler of Asgard, Thor, the protector god, and Loki, the trickster, and Freya, goddess of love. And that is it for uh, this versus video. So which gallery do you prefer? Um, I've been through the Disney gallery. I've been through the Bijutsu Khan gallery. I don't think I've been through any of the others though, but the Bijutsu Khan gallery was very, very pretty. We, when we went to Japan, we actually ate in Japan. We had that really good ramen place and oh my God, it was so authentic and so yummy. And we went through like all of the shops that they had in Japan and we went through this Bijutsu Khan gallery, which I didn't realize what it was until I actually started doing like writing down my verses video which is kind of funny because I was like wait a second we actually went through this gallery and then like after that that's where I got this um this pearl necklace they did the the oyster thing or was it clams it's clams or oysters or mussels whatever holds the the pearls you picked one they bang the gong and then you counted to three it was this whole ritual thing and this is what I got was a pretty pink little pearl and hubby bought me the chain and the pendant that is that it goes into and then after that we went to go get some Japanese treats <laughs> because we wanted to and I got chocolate mochi which lasted us like three days because we had a fridge in our hotel room but anyways um just let me know what you guys think about each of the galleries down in the comment section down below which ones have you been in which ones would you like to go in now um anyways thank you guys so much for watching I love skeletons stay safe love you guys